Welcome to What's Up Oxford. I'm your host, Shannon Woolley, and today I am joined by Fran and Jennifer from the In Inner Kippen District Lions Club and Woodstock yes. Lions Club. Welcome back to the show. Well, thank, thank you, you for having us. Yeah, and we were here last year. We were, and Tatum was with us last yeah. year too, right? Welcome yes. back to the show, Tatum. She has her superhero cape on, cape I think. On. Yeah. Okay. So the walk for guide dogs is coming up again, Saturday, May 25th, 1 p.m. Yes. So what is the goal of the fundraising event? Do you want to take that? Yeah. Or? Go ahead. Well, it's to raise funds for uh, dog guides, which is Lions Foundation Dog Guides. And uh, we have a facility in Oakville that uh, trains dogs for uh, different programs and uh, people with disabilities get the dogs no, at no cost. And so we're raising funds uh, to keep that program going and the training going. To keep the training going, okay. Yeah. So how would somebody get involved? Uh, well, we've got the, the uh, you can donate online at walkfordogguides.com. Just go in there, you look at the location, Inner Kip or Woodstock, and um, they can donate that way. But we're definitely would like people to just come and register on the day too. Um, they can get sponsorships and uh, bring their their sheet. If they need a pamphlet, we'll bring them out to them, um, and they can just come and have a good time that day. We've got like a barbecue truck there. We've got some activities for the kids, and so the whole family can come. Okay. So where does the walk happen? Uh, so it's at the Lions Center in Inner Cap. In Inner Cap, okay. Which is 36 James Street. Okay. And it's at one o'clock on long that long? Saturday. Uh, so we've got two walks. One will just be like a short walk for 15 minutes. The other will be a 30 minute walk. And it'll just be through Inner Cap. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Come and back and have a hot dog, hot dog. And is it open to family as well? Obviously, you mentioned Ab there's some activities absolutely. for kids so families can come. Yeah. What about families with fur babies? Are other dogs welcome? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Other dogs are welcome. Okay. And Talk if, about and the if invisible you, dogs. And if you don't have a dog, <laughs> one might be around. <laughs> then you can walk. <laughs> that you can walk. Okay. So come out, even if you don't have a dog, <clears throat> come out, have a go for a walk and have some fun, have a hot dog and, um, and uh, activities. And uh, we also have a coloring contest for the kids. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, through Pet Value, we're doing a, uh, a donation board um, for uh, raising funds for the guide dogs as well, because Pet Value is one of our big sponsors for the, for the uh, guide dogs. Okay. So we will have a poster up <clears throat> later this afternoon um, at Pet Value over, um, I don't know where it is. On Norwich Ave. On Norwich Ave. Yeah. And uh, uh, you can donate through Pet Value as well. Yeah. As well. Even if you don't have a dog, we have invisible dogs. Invisible dogs. Invisible, invisible dogs. dogs. So you're going to have to come out and check out dog. those invisible dogs. Check out the invisible dogs. So for any of those families that want to have a dog, maybe they can see what an invisible dog is all about then. Yep. Exactly, and, okay. And we ask kids to, to dress up, um, dress up your dog. Um, it's superhero theme for for this year. So Tatum has already got her cape already on and raring to go. <laughs> well, I must say she's very well behaved because if I said the word walk that many times in my house, my dogs would be going absolutely wild. So she's very, very well behaved. Yeah. Um, so what other clubs are participating other than the Lions Club? Um, so Sweetberg's bringing their, their barbecue uh, food truck, which is great. And we've got Drum, Drumbo coming and uh, Plattsville. So all the surrounding like, communities. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And uh, sweep, uh, I said Sweetberg. You did, yeah. yeah. So if there is a viewer watching that, let's say, for example, has diabetes and is looking to, to get a guide dog, do you know what, could you tell us what that process would look like or how they could apply to, to get a support dog? Um, yeah. They basically go on the website dogguides.com and click on the di diabetic um, link 
and then uh, you fill out a whole bunch of paperwork for your for your doctor from your doctor and from yourself and then you submit it and then they come back and and talk to you about about the about it and go from there so it's it's a, a longer process um, it's very uh, methodical it's thought through and um, and then uh, they try to match you with the right dog okay. so so the walk is happening on Saturday, May 21st at 1 p.m. 25th. Sorry, Saturday, May 25th yeah. at 1 p.m. And that's in Interkip. Interkip. And where can people find the information to register, to donate, to sponsor? Yeah. So they go to um, <clears throat> walkfordogguides.com and you look under the locator and you find a city that's nearest to you. Uh, click on the locator and you can um, find the information on the, the website through there and you can also donate online if you wish to. Okay, wonderful. So. Well, thank you very much for being on the show again and thank you so much for bringing Tatum. It was a joy to have her. You're welcome. Our pleasure. <laughs> We're gonna take a short break. We'll be right back.